Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is Pure Kicks back again with another. Are we on the right side? We're not, are we? No, nah, it's cool, man. Because you were worried about that being your bad side. That's why we changed the. No, we're on the right side. We're not. I sit on that side. <laughs> no, we're not. We're on the right side. We're fully on the we're right fully side. Fully on the right I'm side. I'm fully on the left hand side. Run Ooh, it back. That Run it back. Weird. This is new. Anyway, new tick. Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is Pure Kicks back again with another. It's not even another. It's not another video. One of our bro. first. Yes, sir. Ranking videos. You guys have seen it already. The Kyrie 7 has been announced. It looks cold. Bro. Bam. Don't worry, we've got content coming for that. Yeah. So just relax over there. But before it gets here, it only makes sense if we rank the first six years of Kyrie as we rank our favorite shoes and put them in order. That's what ranking is, basically. Basically. Yeah. So enough talking. Let's get it. Yeah. At number six, I hope this doesn't upset anyone, bro. That's the, that's the whole video. We don't want to upset anyone. It's cool. We have the carry twos. Sorry, bro. So sorry. The reason being yeah. is because of the breaking time. Oh, it's a big reason. The breaking time was mad. It was crap. It was terrible. It was horrible. Especially in that first red colorway, you know, the red and black of colorway. Of course. Yeah, oh yeah, my yeah. God. Was that, the um, Inferno, Inferno Red or something, something like that? Something like that. It was cool, it was a cool colorway. Call it Inferno Breaking because it didn't do that, it bro. It didn't do it. I know oh. a lot of you guys had this shoe. This was one of the top selling shoes at the time. Yes. But for me, Breaking Time was horrible, right? Yeah. This is actually, some people don't know this, this is the first shoe to take away four foot zoom. Why take away four foot zoom? I didn't add up. So that wasn't you know a good mean? experience for me. Don't get me wrong, I did enjoy the rounded outsole. Do you know what I mean? They did Buff. provide a nice court feel. Yep. Um, I think the whole campaign at the time was, you know, cutting in different directions and whatnot. It did that. It did that, but it's the worst carry. Yeah. It's going to have to sit there. Yeah, you know I mean? Before we get any, going to any more, they're all going to be in the BHM colorway, just so we're clear. Shouts out Black History Month every single time. That's just what we have in the collection. Yes. So it's a Black History Month. It's a Timmy's collection. It's not my collection. It's, a, it's, it's my own thing. This is my collection. This is what it is. This is what I have. It's what I own. Let's move on. Coming in at number five. I don't think it upsets too many people. No. Again, this shoe went off the shelves. It's got to be the Kyrie 3. Ah, this one's tough for me personally. This was tough. To I that. think this is arguably the best looking Kyrie. It's in there. I really like the way it looks. But the <laughs> lack of cushioning, oh my days. Oh. Again, no zoom in the forefoot nah, or fun. in the heel. And I don't think there was anything in the We didn't have the it in the heel. We did have it in the heel. We did have zoom in the heel. Sorry, yeah, zoom in the heel, not yeah. none in the forefoot. And I don't think there was anything in the forefoot. Nah, no, it was nothing. Maybe just insole. Just, 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 just life. Insole, just life. Insole and then rubber. 2020 was in the forefoot. That's what was, oh, that, that was just it. And then on top of that, <laughs> the shoe didn't want to break in. Again, oh, nothing changed. Bro. We went up a shoe, breaking time just remained. Yeah. I will say, this traction was insane. Yeah, though. the traction was dumb. Ooh, traction was crazy. Can I say it's the best traction out of all carries? Yes. Yeah, I'll take it. Yeah, it's in yeah. there. But it still has to sit at number five. Yeah. Because yeah. there's a lot to follow after that. You have to give us some, something more than just traction. You, you know what I'm saying? Literally have to. Yeah. I mean, for me as well, it just looks better than the two, so it's in there. Yeah. It's in there at number five. Yeah. It's going to sit there. Coming in at number four, we have the Kyrie 6. Ooh, hold on, real quick. I will say this. It's not in the BHM colorway, because that colorway didn't drop in the EU, so I don't want to hear anything from any of you lot. This is just the colorway we have. Just yes. for direct. And the reason why it's in this fourth spot is because it's the ugliest looking carry. There is a great reason to be in number four. It's hideous. It's not the best looking of all of them. Oh, I hate the way it looks, man. It, it wasn't really, designed right. Yeah, it wasn't like designed right at one. all. Didn't like this one. And not only is it the ugliest carry, it's also the heaviest out of the bunch. So, which is weird because the way we're approaching this shoe, I don't know how it's in fourth. Yeah. It doesn't really add up. It doesn't add up, but there's good reasons why. It has zoom turbo, first and foremost. It has the forefoot, yeah. which means it's already in front of the other two. Exactly. So it has to be there. It does make, now it makes it should make sense to you guys yeah. why it's there, 100%. And it's probably the most supportive Kyrie as well. The strap definitely does its job, even though it's not, uh, it, it's not great it's not in terms of, you know, what a strap should do, but what, it does lock you in. What a strap sh could do in yeah. 2019. 
What a strap could do in this day and age is it just doesn't do that. All it yeah. does really is hold the foot a little bit and just add weight. It's not a great strap. Meh. Real quick, before we move on, make sure you like this video if you're enjoying this content. Make sure you comment down below what your thoughts are on all of these Kyries. What is your top six Kyrie ranking? Yep. And of course, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Must. Hit that bell and stay notified every time we drop a new video. And lastly, check your boys out on Instagram. Come on. At This Is Pure Kicks. Every single time. Because we live life there. That's what we do. Moving on into number three. It's a tough one. It because is. Because this one could, for me personally, could be the second. It could our, be the in, second. In our rankings, you know what I'm saying? I start by saying it's, it's definitely up there for best looking as well. Yes. I know the threes are in there. It's got to be the Kyrie 5. Yeah. Now, for me, this was the first shoe to have Zoom Turbo in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it yeah, gets yeah. A kind of a nostalgia point from there because I remember I was gassed when I heard yeah, about yeah, that yeah, announcement. Yeah, for sure. Four Foot was back. We love to see it. This fly trap lockdown system was insane. It yeah. felt really good on foot. My problem with it was the lacing on it made it real confusing. Yeah. It became a kind of a chore sometimes yeah. lacing them up. But once really you cool. got it down, it felt good. But I liked them. Yeah. I liked them a lot. For me, it was the durability, mm. the fly wire um, that's a part of the actual fly trap. Yeah. Um, in my pair, they ripped, do you know what I'm saying? After two games. Yeesh. So not great. I had to return them. Um, but apart from that, they're, in my opinion, probably the best looking carries that team mentioned. Sinus, sinus, sinus. So, yeah. Number Why three. it's not at two or one? The traction wasn't epic in yeah, these, bro. Yeah, it wasn't. I don't know what was missing. It just wasn't. Yeah. Meh. All the carries have great traction. Even, including this one. But this one may be the worst. So there you go, that's it. It still had good traction, but when it comes to ranking them, yeah. it doesn't get to be up there for real. But happily take the third spot because that's what you deserve. Coming in at number two, we have arguably the most iconic Kyrie. The Kyrie One. I hear it for iconic, bro. Bro. I hear it. This shoe, at the time, was the shoe that we all needed. Oh, talk yeah. to them. At the time, Nike had their heavyweight signature athletes, yep. LeBron, Kobe, and KD, and yep. Kyrie came through like their little brother. The little brother that we can all relate to because he's the handle god and this shoe handle. reflected that perfectly uh -huh. yeah the market on that one was dumb it I was remember. dumb bro the I posters are oh, i was so gassed what was it um something deception that oh, was, that was the red colorway i'll put the picture yeah, up yeah. here now nah, the, no the deception poster yeah, yeah, was, yeah, dumb. Yeah, yeah, it was, dumb. was dumb it was dumb it was dumb the four foot zoom it had it you had it could you feel it? Not really, but it was nice to know that it was there. It was you nice to have the option. Uh, probably the most simplistic looking Kyrie. Yep. Um, one thing I will say is that uh, it lacked support. It did. But who really cares about that when the <laughs> no, shoe looks this no, good, bro? That. Do you know what I'm saying? Look at the shoe. Who really cares about support? You have like to that? care. I mean, the reason it didn't have it because it was lightweight. The breaking time was calm yep. on those. They yep. just broke in straight away. It was. Because it was obviously a first shoe, it got basic yep. Nike tech, but everything we needed was in a shoe. Everything. So it was just a shoe to hoop in. Yeah. For everyone who remembers, what, six years ago now? Jeez. Seven? Yeah, something like that. Wow. It's in Most there. Most iconic carry. It's in there, it's in there. So, we've made it. Yes. All right. For those who've been paying attention, you guys know what's in the number one spot. There's only one shoe that's missing. Uh, what can I say about this shoe? Fam. Uh, this is a basketball shoe. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. There are some things we didn't love about it. There were... They, yeah, let me not even talk too tough. But it's a basketball shoe. Coming in at number one has to be the Nike Kyrie 4. And in this colorway, it goes dumb as well. It goes so dumb. Oh, my God. Why is it everything we need? One, traction beastly. It was disgusting. The fraction, staircase, treacherous traction pattern. I think I said that right. If you, if you know us, yeah. if you've been with us from back day, I think it's the fraction, staircase, traction pattern. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a fraction. What Tetris, is it? Tetris. Tetris, yeah. staircase, traction. No, there's one more word. That. Starting out with a traction, we've got that modified herringbone <laughs> stairs. I call it staircase, Tetris, modified herringbone. Say that again, flow. Staircase, Tetris, modified herringbone. Staircase, Tetris modified herringbone. It's light. 
you might let us know the conversation for the moment. I don't care. But that traction went crazy. Still does to this day. I love to see it. When you see it as well, that zigzag through the middle, on and a zigzag is the flex groove, and that actually helped the shoe flex with you on every single step, and it did the absolute trick. It wasn't just there for the design, it felt amazing on the foot. And I'm also gonna talk about the heel zoom. Yes, talk about it. It's heel zoom. It's heel zoom. We've already made it clear that those shoes with four foot zoom get a little something, but this one didn't have it. Tell, Flo, tell them why it still hits the number one spot. Kushlon. Come on, shoot. Instead of Phylon, Stiff ass phylon, they gave us cushlon. Because you deserve it. And it was sweet. And the reason why, for me personally, this is my number one category, right? Is because I feel like, or I felt like, Nike listened. Thank you! They gave us the one, iconic, amazing. A little bit stiff, but it was great. Two, stiff AF. They could care less about us. It That's was ridiculous. I, I felt like they got everything they wanted and they left in the morning. And then the carry three, they. They reduced the cushioning even more and made it arguably even more stiff than the carry two. They, they, they text us, like, they, text, they gave us that you up text. Do you I know what I'm I saying? I deserve it. I deserve more than that. And then Nike got the carry four. This is a new boyfriend. And they said, you know what, you man? You've been struggling with no cushioning. Yeah. Yeah. We'll give you some cushion. Thank you. And it felt amazing. It transformed the carry shoe line in my, in my opinion, bro. Fam. Uh, before the four, the carry in my mind was a stiff shoe with great traction. That was it. That was what we had. But that miss that that conception changed completely when this shoe dropped. Yeah? And not only did it feel amazing, but the materials were incredible. They they complemented the cushioning so well. 100 percent It was bro. insane. Support was really good as well. All in all. It's definitely the best performing carry. Uh, if you might disagree, let us in the comment section below. But I, I have mean, to touch on. Um, listen to me real quick. The colorways in this shoe. Yeah. The colorways that came out in the Kyrie Four. It's hard to follow, bro. It's hard to follow what colorways that dropped in this shoe. Damn. I don't even mean anything, yeah, but it's just, in there. Let's just leave it at that. Kyrie now. Four. There you have it, guys. So, all right, guys, there you have it. That is our Kyrie's rank as we prepare for the Kyrie 7. Whew. It's been a great run. Great run, It's been bro. a great, great run. It makes sense that the Kyrie 4 takes the top spot followed by the 1, then into the 5, then into the 6, then into the 3, and into the 2. If you agree, comment down below. If you don't agree, comment down below. We want to hear what your ranks are, even if you haven't even tried them out, if it's just by looks. Comment down below what you think the Kyrie line should be ranked at. If anyone puts the Kyrie 2 in the number one spot, yeah, that's... Uh, Flow is spoken. Yeah. Relax in the comments, yeah? Make sure it makes sense. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. Comment down below. Of course, like the video to support your boys. And of course, hit that beautiful red button and the bell next to it to get notified every time we drop a new video. That red button is for subscribe, by the way. And if you haven't, follow your boys over on Instagram. Show us love over there. Yeah. Make sure you're up to date on all the new videos and all the latest content from us. That's what we'll be doing our thing. Hold that for me. I'll hold that. Yeah, hold that. Keep going, keep going. You did yeah. a great job. I don't even know what else to say at this point. I just know that they're ranked. Everything is great. If you agree, if you don't agree, it's fine. But make sure you comment down below. So there you have it. That's our Kyrie signature line ranking done. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That's right. Without further ado, we're Pure Kicks. Let's, Let's get, get it. it.